morning and welcome to Clown. It's been a while since I've done a, a video local to me. I seem to be going all over the all over the country at the moment making videos. It was nice to just get out locally this morning. So I'm in Clown Linear Park and some stage last year, I think it was this summer, could be wrong. They uh, they installed some information boards along the park. Now the park's built, it's called Linear Park. It's built along the um, the track bed or around the area around the track bed of an old disused railway line uh, and it's the, the boards are aimed at history and nature so I'm gonna have a walk around and show you around some of the things that the boards are telling us about the local area If anyone doesn't know Clown, it's in, it's in the North East Derbyshire area, um, kind of east of Chesterfield, south east of Sheffield. So Clown Linear Park, uh, we're coming up to the first of our information boards here. Now they are numbered, so that's going to save me the embarrassment of, uh, of me trying to count. I can't remember how many boards there are in total, I think, is there eight or nine? maybe 10 i can't remember we'll find out i have walked around them before so i uh, but i've not got the, the best memory so the first one is the site of the former railway goods yard now the old station is just the other side um the other side of these trees and we've actually got the platforms or where the platforms used to be coming down here so yeah the first board just telling us a bit about, about the goods shed that's looking in the opposite direction. That's looking from up towards from towards the station. So we're stood round about here, looking back on ourselves at the moment. Nothing left of that those sidings, unfortunately, from the good shed. But just walked past on my way in, and those little row of houses there. That road is called the sidings, so at least it has left some legacy. Right, so from the old good shed and the sidings, we'll, we'll crack on, find the rest of the boards. So incidentally, I'm not going to spend ages telling you about this, um, but if you look up here, just make our way through the undergrowth, you see those, that line there, now that's the edge of an old station platform. That was to do with the good shed. Now, I have covered this on other videos. You'll, you'll hear me referring to these other videos. I'll leave a link to the video. You can just uh, tell you a little bit more about some of the remains around this, the start of the, uh, of the linear park. But yeah, some great things to find. Well, there's some great things to find all the way along, to be honest. Straight away, the second information board for the old rectory garden. Rectory, we've just walked past it on that side, and you can just see through the trees there that's the old rectory pond, and then the rectory gardens just behind it. So, board number three clown station signal box. You can read there. So this is the railway line. And we've got the Clown Branch, Clown Greenway on the right hand side there. The LDECR on the left hand side. And we had Southgate Colliery branching off over there. And then the Goods Yard over on the left. And then we've seen these boards before on when I've done the old disused railways of Clown videos last year couple of photographs there it's the old clown clown south station that's the footbridge over this line I went just behind us there this isn't 
part of the trail itself, but I, I always like coming down here. Just on the uh, little bit of a, a cutting and some culverts just in between the two railway lines, just flanking us either side here. We do have a couple of, uh, so that's going back in the direction of the rectory under there. And then that one's the clown, the clown branch, Midland Railway on that side. Little culvert at the bottom there, not in the best condition. A bit clattery this bridge, no apologise. Yeah, a nice retaining wall. Used to have the culvert there as well. So we just saw the signal box information board, didn't we? I can't remember now off the top of my head the exact location of the signal box. I came out here with Pete about a year ago. It was snowing that day and he was averaging and rummaging around on this uh, on this hillside and he did actually unearth um, one of the big pulley wheels about I'd say about nine inch in diameter. It was from the signalling system. Yeah, it was a good day out that we found found quite a few bits and pieces around here. Again, not on the trail, not part of these boards, but it's just interesting to come down here and have a look. We've had to come down to the bottom of these stairs just off the railway embankment up there for board number four and this is Clown Crags. You can see from that photograph there. So the church is just to the right hand side. You can't really see it these days and there's a lot more trees today. So that's the railway embankment just there on the left hand side. So we'll go back up, find the next board. So just a little update before we move on. Looks like I just filmed this in time because when I come back a week later, we've no longer got that same view down towards the crags. So you'll have to use your imagination with this information board. This is the linear park. Now it's a green space in the middle of Clown, as its what's the name would suggest. It's built on the old Lancashire, Derbyshire and East Coast Railway track bed. Linear park, I suppose the clue's in the name, it's, it's a linear a linear path, isn't it? It's, it's built, built uh, based on a railway line. Kind of clever play on the name. We have got this bench here. It's been I use light to have a look at this every time I come past. It's been engraved there, the steam locomotive, the Lancashire, Derbyshire and East Coast Railway, 1896. Which is when that line was built through Clown. And board, and in that board we've just seen on Clown Crags, we can see, we can still see some of these crag, these rocks on the side here. Yeah. It's nice. I mean, look at the texture. Is that erosion? Ooh, the texture on these, uh, those rocks. It's very typical of the area, isn't it? This, you see it in the cuttings along the disused railway lines, up towards Creswell Crags as well. All the walks around there. All right, I'm gonna get back up there now. Board number five, wild. Flower Meadow. Still following the disused track bed. Looking back to Clown. So it really is a long, thin park. And he is is board number six. It's called Linear Pathways, as you can see.
so it's just telling us about the railway sidings that we used to store wagons wagon wagons full of coal all right okay so this is where the the banker engine for the clown greenway part didn't realize that so if we just bring you back here we have got a path going in that direction and then the path going in that direction that'd be the main line clown so num board number seven clown saint john the baptist church which is just over there we could see that in that photograph couldn't we of the crags earlier on in the trail Here's board number eight, Blizzard Meadow. Again, I believe this little clearing was railway related. Is board number nine, Holland Hill North Line. So there's the steam engine there. That's just coming down the railway line. That's just the other side of this little stone wall. So it's just saying uh, you can spot the tawny owl that lives down here. Now I don't think there is any more boards this way. I might be proven wrong. I thought there was, forgot that was board, board was there to be honest. But I'll have a walk down to the bridge and we'll come back down the, uh, what was the main railway line. Just, it's just on that embankment, if you can just see it, just through there. So here's the bridge. It's the bridge over the, the Midland Railway. It's just joining us. Just joining us there. See double arch, but there is actually three arches. There's one just hidden behind that tree there. This is Holland Hill Road. Is it Holland Hill Lane? I can't remember. Going over the top, and that's the that's the clown branch down there. It's now it's now the clown greenway. Now you let me keep mentioning these disused railways, which is what I'm interested in. It's what I've made videos in um, around here before. Um, if you're not from round here or if you're not interested in this huge railway, it probably won't mean a great deal to you. So I do mention the Clown Greenway a few times, don't I? That's Clown Town Centre in that direction. If you look back that way, that goes back, back towards Creswell. Only a couple of miles down there, but we're led back up through the Linear Park. You can see on that signpost. So this would be the end of Linear Park. Now that's the, we're on the road obviously at the moment, that's the staircase back up on, into the park, onto the track bed, the old disused railway line. But we did have a bridge coming across the road here that there is no remains of today. A nice arch bridge. Obviously I'm far to, uh, a bit of a squeeze. Um, I am far too young to remember that bridge that was knocked down way before I've been on the scene um, but I do recall I can't remember where I saw it and I've seen a photograph and yeah it was a nice quite a quite a substantial bridge that crossed the road here so it is a is a surprise that there's nothing left of it so see, I've walked down the park and I'm now heading back down now it's gonna walk back the old down the old track bed towards clown right so here's the track bed it's the old railway line straight as a die straight into clown in there uh, just under a mile in front there ah one last board i wasn't aware this one was here board number 10 holland hill south line so i was just explaining wasn't i about that bridge over the road and there it is there's a photograph maybe 
And I've got such a bad memory. That's maybe where I've seen that the photograph of that bridge actually. So that bridge. So we're on the trap bed, obviously, that would have gone over the road. That bridge is just where that couple is walking there, just approaching. So I hope you've enjoyed this little wander around Clown Linear Park, just having a look at some of the information boards. Come down yourself and have a look yourself. I didn't plan today. I was... Um, I was just doing some shopping in Aldi and I just don't so happen to still have the GoPro uh, in the back of the car so I thought it's another morning for a walk I thought I'd just come and do this in the spur of a moment so if you've liked this video have a look at some of my other videos on uh, on my channel I've done quite a lot of videos around Clown and the surrounding area mainly around the disused railways because that's what I do so I've done a lot of the, uh, the disused railway lines that go through Clown and beyond. So cheers for watching, take care and I'll see you soon.